You don't even have to upload your shorts from a smartphone or an iPhone. You can actually upload your shorts from a computer, a laptop, or a MacBook. And today's video, I will guide you through the process. Hey everyone, Andrew Morrison here. Welcome to my channel. Here on my channel, I help brand new and already existing entrepreneurs, business owners, coaches, consultants, and course creators to turn a YouTube channel into an online education business that can grow and scale to six and seven figures. Subscribe, hit the bell, and the like button below, and let's get into the video now. Now, in order to actually upload your shorts on your computer, your laptop, or your MacBook, you first and foremost need to make sure that your shorts was filmed uh, vertically in vertical mode and you also need to make sure that the dimensions are set correctly 1080 by 1920 and then you can either send your shorts video either from your phone to your computer or you can also simply edit that shorts video on your computer as well again set in the right dimensions now uh, in order to upload the shorts, you obviously go to YouTube Studio and then you go to camera icon where it says create and I will guide you through the process. You go to upload video and I am using today a video that I actually already uh, put up on my channel recently all to actually how to make a YouTube short video. And so we will use that for example purposes. You drag and drop as I just showed you. So first and foremost, the title is really important, especially when it comes to YouTube because it is a search engine. And you wanna first make sure that you do have hashtag shorts in your title as well. So again, title is very important. And then moving next to description, uh, the description you also need to ensure that you have shorts also hashtagged as well. And then you can just simply uh, copy and paste a description like I just did so as well. And then going down next, uh, you can either do a custom thumbnail. I use Canva, by the way, for all my thumbnails. Or you can also use... Uh, a thumbnail from your other, uh, from your video, actually from your shorts video. And that will appear in these different boxes. You can just simply choose a different uh, slide and picture. And then um, make sure that's not made for kids as well. And then I'm just guiding you through the process. Uh, you can possibly do the tags as well. Uh, video language, if you want to uh, attach it to subtitles and things of that nature. And then I will guide you through the process next. You click on next. And then you can add subtitles if you would like. And then uh, end screen and cards are optional uh, when it comes to the shorts, adding that and uploading that through your computer. And then you go to next. And then once you get to visibility, you wanna make sure it is set to unlisted. Anytime you do upload a video, whether it's a shorter or longer version, you wanna make sure it is set to unlisted. And then you click on save. And then once you're actually ready to actually publish it, then you uh, set it to actually public. And then you, from there, you can actually save it as well. And then I also wanna show you another cool trick as well that might actually come in handy for your audience members. So after you actually successfully uh, uploaded it uh, public, you made your shorts public. Then you can also go to the left to customization on the left side of the screen in YouTube Studio. And then you can also add your shorts uh, from your computer through a section. And that is a really cool trick as well. It just makes everything really neat, organized, and structured that way. So I hope you found today's video very helpful. 